Yeah. Hey, just to wrap up with Ronda, you feel you feel good that her fighting days are done? I mean, could she ever come back for one more? I wouldn't want to see it. I don't want it to happen. I care about her. Um, she's got enough money. She's got enough money and all that stuff. I don't want to see it happen. It's like Chuck Liddell. I was hearing that Chuck was talking about fighting again. I hope that's not true. Has Ronda mentioned that it's to you at all? Like, I kind of thinking? Or? No. 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 She's, she's super happy. She's traveling. She's hanging out. She's doing her thing, you know? Imagine never having a personal life. And then you get one. And then you go into wrestling, and it's really private. <laughs> yeah. Isn't she like other people in the sense that she loses to Holly, and her confidence was blown? That that was a very non-confident Ronda Rousey that fought Amanda. And while Amanda may be the better fighter, she's certainly not probably that much of a better fighter. So Ronda was like everybody else in a way in the fact that, hey, she got beat, and all of a sudden her, her confidence <coughs> was gone, wasn't it? What does it remind you of? Tyson. Tyson. I always used to compare her to Tyson, and it's totally like Tyson. I, I agree. Yeah. Hey, have you, you know, since you're close it's with like him, have you ever kind of probed that with him and ask him, like, hey, what happens when you lose that aura that is there? Did he ever talk about it? No. No, I've never I've never asked him that. So how I've asked him a lot of shit. I've never asked him that. It'd be interesting <laughs> to hear what he says. <laughs> yeah. Everything is interesting to hear what he says. I, I just, talking to that guy is incredible. Thank you.